get out of here and you see this first piece of decking which will eventually end up on the other side of the river is just phenomenal. And uh, when the centre airframe comes, which will be delivered during the winter months and then erected and pulled up, it's going to be higher than Big Ben. It's the economic uh, benefit that it brings. It, it's been able to move our, our commodities, our manufacturing commodities around into the port and bring other stuff in. Also, of course, pedestrians will be able to walk across it. In 15 minutes, I understand, you can walk from the north side and be at the metro station on the Pollyon side. So I joined here, I joined Farron's uh, last October when it was, um, wasn't a great amount here and I worked on this section just behind us from the ground up. So when I started there was um, about 900 concrete piles in the ground and um, since then we've cut it down, poured uh, concrete pile caps on top and built up the uh, stone to the level that you can see here. From there we've... Um, put more concrete launch pads in which is what the bridge is actually resting on now. The VB came in put their steel on and then it was my job to arrange the uh, precast concrete panels. They've been put on top there just behind us um, and that was a couple of weeks ago and now we, <laughs> we're pushing them out and launching everything. And when actually it was going to be built and who was going to build it. So as soon as I heard that Farrens had been awarded the contract I applied immediately for a job with Farrens to come and work on this project. Um, so I decided quite early on that this is something I want to be involved in. I've been really lucky that this is something I've had such a great section to actually work on and, and help out with. Uh, the first part of two is being launched uh, as we speak over the uh, over the wear. It's, uh, it's a bridge part um, uh, with a length of 172 meters weighing uh, 2,500 tons which is being pulled over uh, the wear. Uh, by strand jacks uh, that are attached to the south abutment. Because it will come and appear to stop in the middle of the river where it will stay for a couple of months until we get the pylon erected. Uh, and once the pylon is erected we will then undertake what we call phase two launch where we will pull the uh, bridge deck forward so that the steelwork reaches the permanent support on the north bank. Yes, this, we will continue this operation later on today uh, and it'll take a few more hours yet to get the bridge uh, into its position at the end of phase one launch.